Hello. Today I want to show you the Benko Gambit. So let's take a look how it looks. D4, Knight F6, C4, C5, D5, and after move B5, this is already called the Benko Gambit. Basically in Benko Gambit, we sacrifice a pawn to gain more development and a superior pawn structure. He takes the pawn on b5, we go a6, he takes, we go g6, knight c3, we exchange, knight f3, g7, g3. In this position there is a move e4. Hello. You see this? This means that I'll never turn my back on you. And if you don't want to do the same, please subscribe to my channel and show me love. In exchange, I will give you even more interesting content. Alex Chess out. Then he goes f1, we take, d6, g3, castles, g2, d7, c2 queen, we also advance our queen, bishop d2, preparing to attack our queen. We double the rooks and this position is pretty neutral. But if he goes g3, we castle, White goes g2, we go d6, white castles, the knight goes d7, queen goes c2, queen goes a5, rook e1, rook b8, doubling the rooks, bishop d2, queen b6, we go b3, c4. This position is also pretty neutral and both sides have an equal chance to win.